Hi, it's Kristen, and in this video, we're going to talk about how to access and customize your YouTube channel. In the last video, we got logged into your account, and in addition to your YouTube account, you also have a channel. A channel is where you can upload videos or you can manage the content on YouTube through playlists and subscriptions. Your channel has kind of a look to it or a brand. And so if you're using it for school, you want to think about what you want that to look like. So we're going to do that by customizing our channel. On the left hand side here, you'll see my channel and you want to go ahead and click on that. And you'll have a couple of things that you'll be able to customize. The first is the background here or your clip or your channel art. If I click on the picture here, I can edit that channel art. I can upload a photo of my own. There's even some instructions down at the bottom about how to create channel art. Or you can upload from the gallery. Be fair warned, there aren't very many options on the gallery, so you're probably going to want to spend some time to create your own channel art. But for right now, I'm just going to upload something from the gallery. You also have an opportunity at this point to add a picture here. So if you don't have a picture for your channel, you can click on the pencil and again, upload one from your desktop. The last thing you're going to want to do is put a brief description about your channel so people who visit your channel know what kind of content they're going to find there. You don't need to subscribe to your own channel, but you will see the subscription button on any channel that you visit. And then finally, we're going to go into the settings of your channel. They can be found on this cog right here. And here, general settings, you're going to be able to decide if you want to keep your liked videos or your subscriptions private or public or your playlists. I'm going to point you in the direction of the advanced settings because I want you to visit this and think about what kinds of things you might want to do on your channel. It will default to the advanced settings. We're going to just go to status and features. There are some different status features that you can select for your YouTube channel. For example, if you want longer videos for your channel, maybe you're going to upload some 20, 30 minute videos, you'll need to enable that. And you can do that he right here in that status settings. In addition to that, you can also uh, enable some things like live streaming. If you want to embed live uh, videos, you can embed them with your account, but you could do live uh, streaming from your YouTube account. Uh, if you want to edit the video content, uh, that's automatically enabled for you. So there's some different things here in the advanced uh, content and features that you'll want to take a look at. You may also want to look at some uploading defaults. For example, if you always want all the videos that you upload to go to the, your educational uh, category, you might want to select that. Uh, if you want to look at some featured content things or some branding things, again, some of these are pretty advanced. So I would say the two things you really want to look at are some of the uploading defaults and some of the status and features. We're going to come into more details about the Creator Studio in some upcoming videos, but that's a little bit about how to customize your YouTube channel.